What's up? What's good? Welcome back to Destiny's Vlogs. So this little video is gonna kind of be like all over the place a little bit. Um, it's gonna be like October reset. It's gonna be like Vlogtober stuff. Like, let's just get into it. Let's just go ahead and talk about it. First of all, I didn't even know Vlogtober was really a thing. Um, I saw a post about it, but like, I didn't know it meant like vlogging every day of October, but I'm down. I'm down, but I'm late. I'm late. I'm late. I'm late. Cause today is October 6th. So we're six days behind, but I'm gonna just recap my October 1st through 6th with you. And then we just gonna, we just gonna get into it. Your girl got her little Apple watch on y'all. I changed the like, I don't even know how to explain. I changed the little face. So it's cute, you know, got the time on there. How many miles I walked yesterday. <laughs> Big girl teams. And um, yeah, so let's go ahead and start Vlogtober off. I'm about to go for a walk. Um, sorry, that's like the sun that's hitting me weirdly. I was gonna take my dog, but y'all hear me tripping. So when we go on walks, Russ, he like, I don't even know. Like, he's just not really interested in the walks after 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, Russ starts walking slow as hell, and I just bring him back home. So I think I'm going to go on my own personal little walk right now, and then I'm going to go do him a little, there he's shaky. I'm going to do him a little, like, separate walk later, but, like, I need to get my workout in. So we're going to go just with me, just with me. This is the fit, nothing major, you know what I'm saying? T-shirt, I really don't know where I got this from. I wear it all the time, it's like, it's just a little, you know, a little, little something slight. Shorts, my husband's, of course. If you're not wearing your man's clothes, what are you doing? Or your girl's clothes, and if you don't have a significant other, I don't know what to tell you. But I wear this man's clothes all the time, like, especially when I work out, because I don't really have, like, a lot of shorts and things like that. I just re-upped on sports bras, so I have to show y'all my little pickups, you know, but I don't really have like shorts and stuff to work out in. Um, and for shirts, I'm just using old t-shirts of mine or I'll use like some of his t-shirts. But yeah, for shorts, we're going his shorts all the way. I'm wearing my little, you know, <laughs> my little drip. No, I'm just playing. I'm wearing these Adidas. Um, yeah, I really want to get some Hoka's. I think that's how you pronounce it, Hoka's, Hoka's. I think Hoka. It's H O K A, but they're um they're like running shoes, workout shoes, walking shoes, but they're they're pricey. I'll show you guys later. So I'm trying to debate if I want to get those because these to me are not workout shoes and they make my feet hurt. Like I don't know how to explain it, but like my heels hurt and stuff like that um when I walk or when I run or like you know, whatever. But like, I think in terms of lifting, these are pretty good shoes because they're flat. So like, I could just, you know, I could just, you know, lift or like do some squats or whatever like that. But as far as walking, like, I don't think these are meant to be walking shoes. Look at my little baby. Yes, he has a nub, y'all. Don't come for him in the comments, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and feed him too. Ooh, he needs some water too, y'all. Yes, my son drinks bottled water. Um, I don't know what to tell you. He my doesn't. husband and I argue about it because he doesn't feel like he should be drinking purified water, but he will be when his mommy gave it to him. Look at him. You ready? You ready to that food up? Look at him. All right, I'll be back. This is what we keep our house on, like when we go to work. Let me know what y'all keep it on. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit to 73, but we sleep with it on 70, 71. <laughs> it be freezing in this house, and that's the only way I can sleep. Okay, so you may hear like a little like waterfall thing in the background. It's because I'm walking outside. Um, but I wanted this reset to just be a little bit different. I don't know. Because normally my resets are like serious and I'm like sitting down and explaining things to y'all and things like that. But I just wanted this to just be more like just me, you know, talking, being authentic, just, you know, talking normal, which I'm authentic in my other resets. It's just like more like, oh, I'm sitting down, you know. Um, but this one is not like that. So... I guess we could just like recap September and how September went. If you do not know, I do live in Florida. So we did have a hurricane, Hurricane Ian. You know, he came through and he did his big one. I know at my apartment, we lost power for 24 hours, but we left and went and stayed with my dad. So we went to go visit him in Tallahassee while the hurricane was, you know, doing its thing because um, 
where we were it wasn't like an evacuation zone but it was like um how do i explain it was like a maybe you should leave you know so we left <laughs> um spend some time with my dad Woo! Isaac, all right isaac next Woo! all right fade let's go Isaac, Isaac, Isaac. okay <laughs> and my stepmom and my brothers and sisters and it was fun you know like i don't know just got away for a couple of days i was off of work for a couple of days um that's kind of how my september ended and then my october began we did like when we came back we did have to throw some stuff away but pretty much everything in our fridge and freezer were fine it wasn't you know any damage to our place or anything like that i do have coworkers who like literally just got power back just got wi-fi back just like all of that stuff like that trees falling on their houses like you know just things like that so you know it affected everybody differently um i know when people think of a hurricane and they think of florida they think like oh the whole state but i mean like some people got hit and then some people didn't um i know like i think was it fort myers got hit pretty bad i'm not really sure where else honestly but i know different parts of florida got hit differently if that makes sense um, so that's pretty much how my September ended and then my October began. One of the goals I had for September was 75 day hard. And I started 75 hard in September, but I did not finish. I'm going to be honest with you, I failed. Um, I think I got to day 19 or 20. And then when the hurricane came, I didn't work outside. Work out outside. I worked out like you're supposed to do two workouts a day. So I did my workout inside and then... I was supposed to do an outside workout and I wasn't able to do that because we left and we drove to Tallahassee. Say hi. Oh yeah. Your dad go ahead and get in the, get in the truck. And got there late and it was just like, it just wasn't working. Um, sometimes for me personally, I'm learning this about myself. It is a little difficult for me to stick to things when I'm not in my natural element. Um, and I guess that's something I need to work on personally, but I didn't finish 75 day hard and I'm just going to keep that honest with you. But that doesn't stop my fitness journey. My fitness journey is still going, you know, um, that's kind of one of the things I want to talk about in this October reset video, but the fitness journey is still going and we're going to go strong with that because your girl wants to drop some pounds and it's not even really just about dropping pounds. It's just about being like more confident and more like happy with the way i look and the way i feel and really the way i feel is like the like the most important to watch where i'm walking because y'all i walked a rush out here a while ago and i stepped in dog shit and <laughs> ruined my crocs literally y'all the sun is out today my hair looks a little crazy but yeah so after um you know me not finishing 75 hard um i'm kind of sad about it but i'm kind of not honestly i think i would be more sad about it if i felt like unmotivated to continue on so now my goal for myself this month or just like moving forward is to work out at least five times a week that doesn't mean like strenuous workout every single time but that does mean like some type of form of exercise in my body um and that's something i've become more comfortable with just from doing you know a little 19 20 days that i did do inside outside it doesn't matter yoga pilates walking running uh squats lifting whatever that may be um one thing that i know helps me burn a lot of calories and this is like a tip in case you need something like if you're if you're not a gym girly and i'm not a gym girly at all doing the 12 through 30 helped me to burn a lot of calories 12 incline uh 30 minutes and three speed like you will be sweating you will be sweating now if you can't hit that like consistently the whole 30 minutes then i would say do like 12 incline three speed uh 10 minutes and then drop it down to six incline and 2.5 speed 10 minutes and then push it back up to the 12 incline three speed for another 10 minutes and that'll be your 30 minutes whole that's kind of what i've been doing um it does help you still burn a lot of calories trust me it works moving on from the fitness side uh i didn't read any books this in september the only book i really read um and I, i'm saying i didn't finish any books in september um i did start 
uh the one book by tiffany d jackson that i told you guys about i'll put it down below in the comp in the description but i did start that tiffany d jackson book i didn't finish it i was like i said i was really busy in september like i had a lot going on um and then uh i was reading the um the mountain is you book uh i got that as a recommendation off of tiktok a lot of people who did 75 day heart they were reading that book started that i got pretty far in it because i was reading the 10 pages every day for 20 days I didn't finish the book so oh let me pause my workout i always forget but um i did get pretty far in the book but i didn't finish any book in september honestly like i'm just being honest with you i've been to like recording a lot for tiktok but then it kind of made me slack on youtube so it's really hard for me like um i know a lot of people who do like youtube tiktok and instagram they might not work and like all they do is social media but i really want to find a balance between doing at least one youtube video a week and then doing tiktoks every day and i'm trying to it's just kind of hard i notice if i try to put more energy into youtube i slack on tiktok if i try to put more energy into tiktok i slack on youtube and I just haven't been finding a balance. I do work a full-time job, so that's probably why. And then, of course, I have a social life. You know what I mean? I don't want to record every single thing I do in life um, just because I do want to live in the moment and actually experience my experiences fully, if that makes sense. Um, but, again, like with social media, it's just being more consistent, I guess. Um, like I said, I was really consistent on TikTok, so I guess just being more consistent now on YouTube. I don't know, y'all. Um, but that's a goal for me for October. All right, let's get it. I didn't even notice this, but I guess by our apartment. So you see how these like trees are leaning? See how this tree is leaning? So yeah, I guess we did have a little like hurricane, you know, wind, you know. And I'm wondering if like, this is to the garbage. I wonder if the sidings got like blown off or something. I don't know. Bruh, every time we come home, he's literally right by the door if we leave him out. Okay, so oh, this is something new. It's like a new little addition. I know it's kind of like weird, but hold on. let me take the stuff off of it that doesn't belong on it. No, that's not us, obviously. All right, so we needed like a little like table by our front door to like put keys, mail, you know, stuff like that. I'll put my purse there, obviously. Um, so I went and picked up this table off of Offer Up. I think it was like twenty dollars, um, and then. After that, when I was at Target, I saw these little, like, cute little, like, I don't know what these are called, like, bowls or something. So, I got these. Um, these, this doesn't even serve a purpose. <clears throat> I don't know what to put there. But the, the, the main event, the main, the, the top girl right here uh, for the keys. So, yeah, it's cute. Um, above it, I'm really trying to figure out, like, what else I want to do here. I kind of want a, like, a circular mirror here. But then I kind of just want a big piece of art right here, too. But I think I'm going to do the circular mirror here and then get a shoe rack under here for our shoes. Like, you know, my husband's shoes, my shoes by the door. Put the shoe rack under here, circular mirror here. Yes, you'll see this shirt in the next video. But I want to go ahead and finish, like, talking to you guys about, like, my October reset and, like, recapping October 1st through the 5th. Yeah, through the 5th. Um, no, through the 5th? Through the 5th. <laughs> through the 5th, my bad. Um... So, like I said, October 1st, we just came back home, grocery shopped, and, like, got the house, like, clean and things like that, and just check for damage and stuff like that. Um, and then on October 2nd? Yeah, 2nd, Sunday. Um, what did I do October 2nd? Oh, I went out with my cousins, and we went to Starbucks. We did kind of, like, some planning for our business stuff. Um, we each have, like, things going on. And then I kind of planned out a little bit of content, and I should have put Vlogtober in there. But I didn't. Um, so we planned. I planned out some content for myself. Um, and we went to Ellington Mall. And I got some cute stuff. If you want to see what I got, it's on TikTok. Go look at my TikTok. Um, but I got some stuff for like working out and things like that. And then, sorry if you hear the coffee maker in the back. And then I just came home and got ready for the week. This week was closed week because last week, which was originally closed week, we had the hurricane and we had to leave and, you know, all of those things. It's been a busy week of me working, but of course, since I'm doing Vlogtober, you will see closed week for um, October. So you'll get to see the busyness of it. So yeah, just working. I'm an accountant, if you don't know. So I work with numbers. I work for First Watch Corporate. So all of the restaurants, financials, things like that, if you will, might be boring to you. <laughs> but I don't want to go too much detail into exactly what I do. But, um, but yeah, that's really all my week has been. 
October 1st to the 5th, that's what happened. Nothing crazy, nothing special. Over my goals for October, my goals for October are to, I wanna at least complete two books, two. Two books. One is that Tiffany D. Jackson book, and then I'll have to find another book I want to complete. But I want to complete two books. I want to continue to work out. So my goal is at least five days a week. Workout. Some type of workout, movement, whatever. At least. Counting my calories. Staying in a calorie deficit. I'm using the app called Lose It. And it's going pretty well. Uh, financial goals. Pay shit off and stick to the budget. That's really all it is. It hasn't changed. To my credit cards now more though for like uh, daily purchases because I heard it's good to do that. I'm sorry the camera's shaking. It's my hand. I gotta get my camera. It's in my husband's car and I'm using my phone right now. But I'm using my credit card for daily purchases and daily uses now. If you want me to go more in depth about that, I can in another video. It's just like for gas, food, activities, things like that. Paying the balance off at the you know before it reports to the credit bureau. I'm trying to think what else. I don't really have any like, uh, stay up, up with Vlogtober, of course. Try to find some consistency and balance with posting on TikTok and YouTube. Yeah, that's my that's my October goal. It's my October reset. It's pretty quick, simple, and to the point. I can't really think of anything else, but this is me doing my October reset with you guys. Recapping October 1st to the 5th and then kind of giving you a little bit of snippets of October 6th. The October 7th Vlogtober Day 7 video will be so much better than this, y'all. I'm sorry if this seems a little rushed, but like I want to get on the bandwagon and then like I forgot about the reset. It's just been a really crazy couple of weeks. That's just really what it's been. So thank you for watching this video. I kept it short, sweet, simple to the point. And if you're new, welcome, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, only positive teens, only positive vibes. And make sure you turn on your post notifications because your girl is doing Vlogtober. Yeah, yeah. Just stay tuned for Vlogtober. Make sure to subscribe and turn your post notifications on. Okay, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.